We're in Cincinnati, home of the Cincinnati Mangles at the Concrete Jungle. You know, people say this town is a real hellhole. <laughs> they couldn't be more right. You know, my Goober driver almost fell into this giant sinkhole on the way to the hotel. Hey, don't surprise me. One of Satan's favorite cities to hang in. Makes sense he's got his own highway to hell, right? Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's gonna have it all. The Sniffle Thrills battle. The Cincinnati Mangle. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Grim Blitzrow with you along with my partner, former player Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. And his life partner, the mini mutant head that lives on the shoulder of Bricks Jr. Hey, you just threw up on my shoulder. I don't often drink beer, but when I do, I get totally shit-faced. I am the world's most intoxicated man. Say that again. First and ten. You can't keep a good mutant down. Second down and more than the QB would like. Man, what a hit that was. It's first and ten. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. First and ten. Oh, what a brutal hit! Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. That was a nice piece of running, Grim. First down and one. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. Oh, man, I love this. Oh, great catch. And that's a touchdown. Touchdown. <laughs> okay. Easy like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. <laughs> the home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's 
first and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. And the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> Second down and long. QB is saying his prayers. And there's a huge gain, and this offense is rolling. Margaret, that was a pass play. Rolling plays are in bowling. Now this one's going to be tough. I hope he has a good enough leg for this one. I saw him trying one on before the game. He looked okay, I think. Not my type, though. A little too mutilated. And it's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. <laughs> First down in a mile. And the defense jumps up time trying to meet him. <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Ah, uh, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead! And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot... with the punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Hey. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hey. Boo, baby, I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. And he's going to have to boot this one halfway to hell. QB's fault. If he held the ball spikes out like he was supposed to, the kicker would have never missed. And it's first and ten. Murphy Brown! What? I mean, first down! What the hell was that? I, uh, I honestly don't know, Grim. And 
It's first and ten. Whenever a player gets big, and then he jars the ball loose, and it's a fumble. That's what happens when you hurdle and take a hard hit. And it's first and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. Just keep pounding the ball right up the gut and you'll tire these guys out. First down. And we've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. And it's first and ten. He picks up nine yards on that catch. And that'll bring up second and one. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And he just nailed him running the numbers for a touchdown. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. Kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra, and my man was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Grim. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Looks like the defense called the ginormous dirty trick. It's a whole lot of player right there. You have a bottle of hot sauce shoved up your ass. Quite the description of that painful head, Junior. Huh? No, no, it's a question here on this online dating profile. It doesn't say if on purpose or by accident. Yeah, I'll leave it blank. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot. And he held on to that one for a first down. First down and nine. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot. He picks up a two. Second down and six. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot. hot. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and 
And it's first and ten. Oh, man, the offense called a murder ball. That's a little on the nose, don't you think? That's and he's off to the races. He's at the 30. Ouch, that's got to hurt. Man, those mutant traps will kill you faster than one of Brick's farts. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The oh, nice hit. <laughs> Second down in a very lot. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grin. You're right. This guy's a brick shit house. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirt. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called straight through the uprights. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. And the defense just looks clueless out here right now. The quarterback calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe side. Well, that's two timeouts burned. And you have to wonder, Bricks, are they desperate or are they in control? Yeah, I'm speaking from experience, Grim. But it really is hard to do both at the same time. And I have mastered it. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. Hey. It goes 
goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They need a good return here to set up the offense. They're going to be able to return this one. And it's first and ten. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that is called for a first down. The quarterback is controlling the clock like the clock is into it. I know I am. And it's first and ten. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of death's constant relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling them time out to stop our own clock. You know, Grim? Oh, with the brutal hit. That's better than throwing a pick, I suppose. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. It's good. Bring it back now. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? And they're taking the field for the second half, and we have got a tie score. Uh, speaking of tie, Grim, me and Hot Wanda, we wanted to try something different, so we tied each other up the other night, and nothing happened because we were both tied up. I don't understand what the big deal is. <laughs> When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Now, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. You got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. Caught it! 
and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self foul, but he seems to have worked through it. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy, and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice, Grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot. That's a killer. It was right there, and then he dropped it. Ah, oh, scumbag is killing me in the fantasy league. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. And they run it for a couple of yards. Third down and eight. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot three. He picks up five on that play. And they'll line up for the punt here. And he put all of his foot into that one. Remember, kids, if you can hear thunder over the sound of screams, the lightning is only a mile away. First and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. Call man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. Someone argue that demons don't have a place in this league, but with moves like that, <laughs> I have to disagree. Are you just saying that because he ripped your face off and used it for book buying? I don't know. I don't see how that's not a valid reason. <laughs> don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sits up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. Yo, seriously, man, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? I will wreck your world. You understand me, Junior? I'll wreck your world.
Second down and a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. And nobody can touch me with an eyeball. I take all you mutants out. Hey, what you talking about? Third down, and the QB is tired of the quarterback's tight spirals. And that unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's Drive Through Funeral Parlor Service, located just off the Beltway, exit five. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh. Oh. And they call a ginormous dirty trick. He's so big that the last time he saw 90210 was on the bathroom scale. <laughs> that was a good one. Yeah, man, I was here on the scale now. They all went out. <laughs> well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on the air. Nice catch, and he turns. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. And he's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. to that one for a first down. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. And that was a perfect pass. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Four yards on that one. And he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy up there. That's what you're after. Second down and six. Just some good old downhill running there as he picks up the first down. And it's first and ten. That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell here. It might be time to change the channel. I think Heidi's playing on Superstation WKRP. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And that pass is good for about five yards. Second down and five. Third down and six. And he snatches that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And he rumbles for nine on that play. And that'll bring up second and one. 
Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. And that's how you run it, folks. Picks up eight there. Second down and two. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. for the touchdown. Well, it's all fun and games until he tries break dancing. Yep, but still says it's always more literal. <laughs> well, this shouldn't be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Got crushed. And it's first and ten. Looks like a pass, and it's bouncing right back to the QB. Oh, it's the sticky ball, dirty trick. Ah, oh, pass the popcorn, Grim. Zoom in on his face, then his crotch. I want to see if he cries or pisses himself first. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he runs it for four yards. Third down and, well, good luck. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? point but you never know with kickers <laughs> the kick is good as expected those are pretty much just gimmies the home team is feeling confident as they get the kick off into the air scoring makes anyone confident it certainly does bricks it certainly does high five The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Grim? Aren't we all? Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. And then Katz will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. Second down in a very lot. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Third down and ten. And he 
reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. Second down and long. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Third down and six. He hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. Two minutes left in the game. Thank God I gotta take a wicked dump. Feel like I'm sitting on a wax candle. Not a nice shoulder, you know. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. Second down. First time out under two minutes. The chess game has begun. It's like chess only. You can kill people. Second down and ten. running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. They stop the clock, but they only have one timeout left. Uh, that's okay, Grim. They can have nine. That's, uh, that's nice, Bricks. But our timeouts are for our sponsors, and we need money more than they do. That was a good throw. And assuming he was aiming for the ground. Oh, hold everything. Looks like there's a penalty on the play. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Quarterback passes for a touchdown. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It's good. <laughs> He'll be going on site here, and the return team is ready for it. No surprises here. First and ten. It looks like the defense handed our shrinking pill. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Second down and ten. Defense calls its final timeout. Good. I gotta run to the John. That means I gotta deal with that grubby little bathroom attendant again. Always pushing his lifesaver's dirty comb, hairspray, cheap cologne on me. Hey, I'm here to take a crap. Not get ready for a date. Well, you never know who you're gonna meet when you're in the shitter. Just saying. And the quarterback drills one in for the first down. <laughs> First and ten. No, well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talk to the end. Second down and ten.
Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, and that one's going to hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that. It's a win for the Cincinnati Bengals at home. Well, I'd like to think we're all winners, Grim. Nah, not your case, pal. Not your case. They come up big today with a solid win, and the opposition will be licking their wounds on the long plane ride home. I heard wounds taste just like chicken. How was it? Scrambles tomato soup. Wounds. Mm -hmm, good. The MVP is about to inspire us with some words of wisdom. Yeah, right. Putting three words together for this guy is like you doing a Rubik's Cube. What's a Rubik's Cube? Moving on. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrail with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.